They tell me that I'm never gonna make it. They want me to do something that could make sense. They hate when I keep dreaming I'll be famous. But I don't give a fuck, I'ma keep chasing. I got all this potential that's deep inside of me. But they hate when you're successful cause they try to be. They sit there being judgmental because you're trying things. And they just want you to settle and do the right thing. So get a good job, don't slack off. Wake up every morning, make a good impression on your boss. Don't do anything that I wouldn't do. And when you're making money, make sure you don't spend it too soon. <laughs> Fuck that, I'll do it. Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. Again, this is Anya and to those of you who are new to my channel, uh, this is me just sharing you my life and my story here working and living in Switzerland as a Filipino nurse. So, the weather is so nice today, the sun is shining, so we need to take advantage of that. So today, let's do a question and answer video because a lot of you are commenting and asking questions on my YouTube, YouTube videos and also on my TikTok videos. And I'm sorry if I won't be able to answer some of those because I'm also working full time and I am also have some side hustles online. Uh, that's why sobrang konti lang yung time ko. But um, I try my best to answer some of your questions. I pick some questions um, for today's video and hopefully I'll give you the information that you need so the first one is from duplicate MD 5 XT so she asked if wala pong employer or sponsor or agency saan or paano po kaya pwedeng makakuha ng credited German language certificate so if you don't have any sponsor or agency you can actually learn German yourself through online and also there are some online courses that you can enroll and also the Guti Institute this is a legit um, a German language provider you can actually um, apply courses to them and you can do the exam to them as well so if you guys are gonna do the German language exam I can recommend two uh, very good institutes institute that are um, really accepted here um, in European one in here in Europe sorry <laughs> the first one is the Guti institute and the second one is the telk so if you're in the philippines um there's a Guti institute in makati so um you can check it out guys so the next one is from Dennis journal um he's asking did you apply by yourself to get a job in switzerland as a registered nurse or you have to take agency to get a job there especially for non-eu nurses so um, for me since i already an e a eu nurse an eu nurse um, i can apply actually um, directly here in switzerland but what i did before is um, through agency because the agency will do everything for you so you don't need to do much of a things they will arrange everything from the applications, the papers you need, and also uh, the interview process. So you don't need to do much of uh, sending papers and uh, talking or sending a lot of emails to the employers. So if you are already in Europe and if you are already an EU nurse, you can uh, apply directly here. It's allowed through online. There's a lot of platform and you can also come he uh, here in switzerland and apply it yourself and for non-eu nurses it's a little bit hard so you really need to uh, find an employer an agency especially an employer that will sponsor you throughout the process because as what i always said um, switzerland is not yet fully open to um, non-EU uh, immigrants or non-EU applicants even though it's, it's you're a skilled worker so there's a lot of requirements to comply but of course it's not impossible and hopefully um, in the near future yes hopefully in the near future mag open na rin ang Switzerland uh, sa mga non-EU nurses so let's keep hope for that and the next one is from 68 6 60 at once 1cy4 <laughs> is there age limit for nurses in switzerland can a 50 years old still work in switzerland 
Um, there's no age limit here in Switzerland as long as you are healthy and as long as you know that you can still able to do the work um, that you are applying to. So, wala, wala siyang age limit. If you're 50 years old, 55 years old, or even 60 years old, you can still apply here um, on a job post as a nurse. And uh, not like any other countries or um, any other, um, what you call that, job posts in some countries, they are limited limited lang yung age na pwede mag-apply. But here, he, there's no age limit for that. So, one of the advantages yun. So, another question is from uh, Christine Living Swedish. So, she asks how much is left after tax. So, it depends on uh, your um, way of living, of course. So, here, as I always said, cost of living is higher than any other part of the euro. But the taxes are uh, lower. So, um, it, it actually complied. So, it depends. So, for me, for example, after tax, um, it ranges around 5 to 6k francs. So, if you uh, are, have more experience, maybe more than 10 years of experience, it is higher than that. And if you are just a new nurse, newbie nurse, it might be around um, 4, 4k to 5.5k francs so mga after tax and also it depends on the region where you live because here in switzerland um, different region different taxes not just one whole taxes in one country so you need to do research that as well in which region do you want to live and work so another question is from uh, christine living swedish so she asks how much is left after tax so it depends on uh, your um, way of living of course so here as i always said cost of living is higher than any other part of the euro but the taxes are uh, lower so um, it, it actually complied so it depends so for me for example after tax um, it ranges around five to six k francs so if you uh, are have more experience maybe more than 10 years of experience it is higher than that and if you are just a new nurse newbie nurse it might be around um four four k to 5.5k francs so mga after tax and also it depends on the region where you live because here in switzerland um, different region different taxes not just one whole taxes in one country so you need to do research that as well in which region do you want to live and work so this is also one of an interested question um from Rina Payod. Hi Miss Anne, new follower here. I would like to know how many years have you been working in Germany be before you can transfer in Switzerland? Love your contents by the way. Thank you. Well, I live and work in Germany for more than eight years. So um, I got my uh, German citizenship, I think on the seventh year but right now in the new law so germany you can apply citizenship now if you are already five years living there without uh interruption so um yeah it's one of the advantages and also there is one question from bab babula the day why 1961 uh, she's from india hello to my indian friends and to my indian subscribers uh she's asking how to move how to move uh india to switzerland for registered nurse so please make a video full details process so i won't be able to do that because i don't know how it is in india and how it's how it is the process there and also how the government um allowing indian nurses to go to to european countries so i'm really sorry but i hope you um continue 
to support and watch my contents and um, since uh, India is non-European citizen I'm not really sure but I think um, you still need to find an employer that will um, sponsor you so that you will able to move here in Switzerland but also you need to consider as well that um, the language is very important so you need to learn German French or Italian so yeah and it's not impossible and um, I think there's are some agencies as well in India you just have to research it as well and yeah if you're here na in in Europe to all Indian nurses that are already here in Europe and they want to transfer here and they are already EU citizen for example um, you can actually apply here directly as well and you need to um, register your papers through Swiss Red Cross so another question from Ragehard 100 um, what kind of visa do you have and can you get residency with it? Do you speak French or German? Will you stay there? So thank you for your message. So I speak German because I live in Germany for a long year. So it is an, un uh, it is an advantage for me to, um, to live and work here in a German speaking part. So I speak German, yes. And French, um, I'm still learning it. Yes, um, just sm small words, some small sentence I understand, but German is my main language here. And he asked um, about the visa, I got the permit B. This is a five years residency visa, and then after five years you can um, upgrade it into a permit C, which is the um, permanent residency. And he also asked if I stay, if I stay here. E, will you stay there Ian? <laughs> yes i will stay here as long as the country want me to stay here and as long as the country uh, need my um need my what do you call that need me um to work here as a nurse so um yes i will stay here and so another question is from sarbi 1837 He's asking if the uh, nursing Ausbildung in Germany is valid in Switzerland. Yes, it is valid, but you still have to recognize this through Swiss Red Cross. You just need to check their websites and um, send the papers that they are need, and they will review it and then they will um, recognize it for you. So that's it for now, guys. So thank you again for those who comment, subscribe, and like my videos and my contents. And I see you again for my next video. Ciao, merci, adieu.